There we go. Is this all a waste of time, I wonder? Can I not do anything with this? Oh, I think I just did all this for nothing. I think I need to go talk to Pura first. I think that's what he was hinting at me for. Probably have to go do certain side quests. Yeah, because I don't think I can climb that yet. Oh, well. Panicked. <laughs> what are you scared? Because I can actually come beat you up now. <laughs> That's interesting. So they also carry these things. Interesting. I wonder if that means if I wonder if they'll give us a post game like after we beat them if like we'll be able to just go through and like oh that'll be so cool if they do that so that we can actually repair the world without having like the monsters around okay it's like another shrine if I had a horse, it wouldn't be that big of a thing, but a spinning device.
interesting. Okay. That's pretty fun. Stable uses the Stable Association's membership system. Oh. Okay. I already know about it. Oh. Well, once again, welcome to our stable. We got you all the horse, and we're here. You can register it. Want to register a horse? Oh. First horse is free. Good, because I only have 20 rupees. Uh, we're gonna name you... Dumbleface. Oh, Dumbleface. <laughs> we'll go with that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Dumbleface, yeah, of course. Uh, Take horse. Aww. Oh, pony points. Oh. This is new. Every time you use a service, you get points. No matter what stable you go to, you can get points for lodging, registering, stuff like that. <laughs> but you've also registered a horse, so you get two pony points. That's new. Oh. Okay. Mm. You can trade your pony points for prizes at the ledger counter. Interesting. I'm probably oh. going to forget about that. <laughs> so this is where we finally get to learn about the malice. Oh. Hey traveler, I'd stay away from that stuff if you care about your health. Folks are calling it gloom. If you get any on you, you'll start losing your strength like it's sapping <sighs> your life away. I touched some gloom while poking around in the depths, and now look at me. The worst of it will recover on its own, little by little, so long as you're on the surface. But while you're in the depths, you won't recover at all. I thought I was going to die down there. Some investigation leader I turned out to be. This is just pitiful. I'm completely reliant on Duval, so I really want to recover by noon. This is malice, is it not? The horse AI is, looks so much better, too. Ooh, they have, like, hot air balloons. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! Hey, buddy, what's the big idea? You can't just walk up behind someone who's standing on the edge of a chasm. For one thing, a nasty accident like that would surely halt the research yep. here. Chasm investigation is super important right now for the Zone Eyes survey team. If even one researcher had to stop, Jasha, who's hard at work on plans ever at Lookout Landing, would cry. Not okay. Oh. You know the giant holes that showed up after the upheaval? There are lots of them, just like this one, all over the world. You can't see the bottom. They're so deep, so filled with mystery. We must continue our research for the sake of our dear Jasha. Oh. See that tower over there? That's where you'll find our base of operations, and incidentally, Jasha. Oh, also, oh. don't startle me again. I'm very busy with my investigation, no matter how much I'd prefer to be in bed right now. I wonder if there's going to be any big scary birds. Oh, yeah, huh? Link's probably just sitting there slamming his head into the wall, being like, I have to do all the shrines over again? 
Again! Probably pissed off. Shape rotation. Okay. Down the hatch. <sighs> as many teleport points as I can find, man. As many as I can find. Six. I need two more, and then I can get another stamina and another health. I don't even know if that's how, how uh, stamina. Because last time it didn't even let me do stamina, only let me do heart, but I th think that was just for the mission. Cares about that at a time like this. Uh. <laughs> down here this is a crystal refinery oh i can take your crystallized charges and use them produce i only have five think you're doing Robbie <gasps> she needs that for her chasm research don't touch any of it without her permission I'll get in big trouble if you do <gasps> hey hey you where have you been Robbie <gasps> don't answer that tell me later for now you should hurry up and go talk to Pira she's been in a tizzy ever since you and the princess disappeared she's in the building with the telescope up on the second floor go see her and give her some peace of mind will ya I told you, talk to me later. For now, you should hurry up and go talk to Pira. She's in the building with the telescope up on the second floor. Go see her and give her some peace of mind. Ah! Oh! Oh! This group's going to join the search. You know what's so funny? Like, they say that Pira's been worried and whatnot, and they're like, wow, Mr. Link, but everyone else you've talked to is only worried about zelda it's like they couldn't give a fuck about link they're like ah eh, he's fine so whatever you need it's gotta wait until <gasps> what is that really you link you've returned i've got to say that it's a relief to see that you're safe i'm graylands head of the monster control crew but we can talk more later you need to report into pira she has to know you're back mm. your interest in our work honors us all but please go tell pira you're safe That hair, those eyes, da da dog, oh. Doctor Pura, the swordsman. The swordsman has returned. <sighs> okay, 
Now where have you been? Linky, you're not a ghost, are you? Hey. That looks interesting. Phew. One step at a time. What exactly happened? Oh, Pura's hot now. And the music's... Her music, her theme song's good. So when you and Princess Zelda go beneath Hyrule Castle, you discover a mysterious mummy which suddenly reanimates. Then, Zelda falls into a fissure and vanishes. That must have been when the castle rose and the ruins fell. Then, later, you wake up on a sky island, saved by the arm that was stuck to the mummy. You get the Pura Pad, from an unusual creature and learn that your new arm belonged to someone named Raru. The Master Sword disappears. You hear the princess's voice and find your way here. Hyrule Warrior vibes, dude. <laughs> huh? Then... Are you saying you came from up there? This Rauru you met. I think that's what the first king of Hyrule was named. Hmm. Are they one and the same? So much of this doesn't make sense yet. Hey, my, my my theory about about the Zonai marrying Zonai Rauru marries a Hylian Zelda. Power from the gods. Come on. Come on. That would make sense. Why is it that doesn't have powers? Because she gets them later. Oh. But I'm certain that mummy you found under the castle must be related to the upheaval. Hmm. The castle rising up. The ruins falling down from the sky. The mummy must be connected to it somehow. Ah. And then there's the most important detail of all. You're sure that you heard the princess speak to you. And she gave you a clear message to find her. If that truly was the princess, then that means she's alive. Maybe she's trapped beneath the castle and needs help. Mm -hmm. That settles it. I know you only just returned, Link. But I need you to meet with the search party up by Hyrule Castle. They've been searching tirelessly for you two. The captain in charge of the search is named Hawes. Work with him to find the princess as quickly yes. as you can. I know that mummy may still be lurking somewhere around there. Which is concerning to say the least, but we have more immediate problems to deal with right now. I'm counting on you, Linky. Bro, th these are cool. This is cool. Uh, so now we have character profiles. The highest authority on ancient technology. She has served Princess Zelda's family for much of her life and has worked with the princess to research the Zonai civilization. Most recently, they started an investigation into the outbreak of Gloom. She has used herself as a test subject in her experiments. Despite being over a century in age, she reversed her aging to the extreme and actually looked like a child not too long ago. I knew it! This is Pura! She's so cute. I can't, dude. Oh, it also tells that she's a Sheikah. Interesting. So if we go here, Hylian, the heir to a power that imprisons darkness. She sacrificed her freedom over a hundred years ago to keep Calamity, Calamity Ganon sealed away and prevent him from further destroying Hyrule. After Link, t after Link helped free her from that long duty, she committed herself to rebuilding and restoring Hyrule, but has now gone missing. I love Robbie. Zonai. Yeah, so he's officially a Zonai. Kinda cute. Hmm. 
On that day, the land shook, and huge chasms that seemed bottomless opened in the ground. The clouds billowed and rolled as floating islands appeared in the skies, raining chunks of ruins down on us. And strangest of all, Hyrule Castle began to float in the air. It's hard to believe this is our world now. Whoever started calling it the upheaval had the right idea. An evil-looking haze surged up from the chasms that opened on the surface. The haze weakens everything it touches. People fall ill when exposed to it. And it has another curious property as well. As if guided, the miasma coiled about our weapons. There isn't a single weapon we know of that hasn't decayed as a result. We're calling the stuff glue. We decided to call the islands hanging in the sky, Sky Islands. Simple and to the point, it's best. And to the point is best, it seemed. I suspect, based on the design motifs on them, that the ruins are falling from the sky are Zonai. We still understand so little about the Zonai civilization. All we know is that it flourished in the sky. While it's true that the upheaval has posed major problems in every aspect of life in Hyrule, I can't deny that it's also presented us with an opportunity to answer questions we've long had about our history. Hmm. We've started investigating the fallen ruins in the Sky Islands. Our best lead is a report from the chief of Kakariko Village that some unusual ruins and engraved slabs have fallen there. I decided to have the Zonai survey team work out of Kakariko Village in Nakluda, southeast of Lookout Landing. The ruins that fell in Kakariko Village are massive. You can see them from all the way out here at Lookout Landing. The crater left by the castle's rise is still spewing gloom. It's kept us from making any real progress with our investigation. We still don't know anything about where the princess and Link have gone. The upheaval occurred very soon after Princess Zelda and Link left to explore beneath Hyrule Castle. I fear the two events are related. Interesting. I like how she has a frog with the eyes on it. Oh, we can go up again. Is this not giving uh, Wind Waker vibes? Sorry, just uh... A stairway leading deep beneath Hyrule Castle has been discovered. Even Princess Zelda didn't know about it, so it seems safe to assume it's a secret removed, even from royal legend. We have confirmed that gloom emanates from that location, meaning something down there must be causing it. I appointed Princess Zelda and Link to investigate. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that Princess Zelda volunteered for the job before I had the chance. I know beyond a doubt there is no team more qualified for such a task, and yet... I can't escape this feeling of dread. I've decided to store this diary in four volumes. That way, if a nosy someone reads it, they'll only have a quarter of it. Such ideas are the fruits of genius. As for the first one, I think I'll entrust it to... Who else but Impa? Speaking of Impa, she's had a cute habit of hiding important items underneath things ever since she was a child. I have a fond memory of when she forgot about a hidden steamed bun beneath a cushion and then sat on it, squashed flat. Diaries are flat to begin with, but as they are more important than a bun, I hope she finds a better hiding spot than a cushion. I bet you anything, Ippa just hid it underneath the cushion. She was just like, fuck it. Tell it's like a new gate. <laughs> Link, it's you? I'm sorry, I had no idea that you had returned. Wait, if you're back, then does that mean we don't need the search party anymore? Huh? You should go talk to Captain Hawes. He's leading search efforts here from the first gatehouse up ahead. You'll find it at the very end of this road. 
Oh. The man has a goddamn pot on his head. I can't take him serious. Did you come up here to help look for Princess Zelda too? Yeah, me and a few others had the same idea. We all owe a great deal to the princess. We were hoping to help anyway. Mm. But the captain is way up top on the gatehouse there. Doesn't look like he's coming down anytime soon. He just showed up. We just showed up without being asked. So uh, best to stay out of the way until we can help somehow. Just like I thought the weapons here have all decayed too. Wonder if there are any intact weapons left anywhere in the world. Oh. Hey, it's a new face. Ooh. During the upheaval, all the weapons, swords, spears, claymores, you name it, suddenly decayed. I've explored many regions in search of weapons that might still be intact. I've found none. At this point, I'd be surprised if there were any intact weapons left oh. in Hyrule. They're also a real pain to repair, so the best thing to do is strengthen them. I see. I never understood that that's what that meant. <sighs> Sorry, but I'm in the middle of something. Huh? Mm? Link, is that you? You're alive and all in one piece, it looks like. Does that mean Princess Zelda is safe too? What a relief. Huh? Hang on, you're alone? But you heard the princess calling out to you and you're here to help with the search? I see. Mm, maybe I don't. I'm a little confused, but that doesn't matter right now. What matters is continuing our search for Princess Zelda. Mm. I'm relieved to see you come up here and help us out though. We needed some good news. The sheer amount of gloom has gotten overwhelming. Our work carries on, but we've been a bit dead in the water. Oh? Captain! It's Princess Zelda! Hmm? Princess Zelda! She's safe! Four. Huh? Wait, what? Hmm? Saw that too, Link. Saw Princess Zelda turn into light and fly off, right? How strange. This this is an emergency situation. Mm. Why would she leave without saying a word to us? We need to let Pura know about this as soon as possible. Considering what we just witnessed, I think it makes sense for us to withdraw, but it will take a bit. Please, you must tell Pyrrha about what happened here as soon as possible. 